Welcome to Bubba's Garage. Last weekend, we built this little table here. We're going to kind of a, a welding table slash all-around beater banger upper table. Well, this weekend, we're going to build another table on wheels uh, for welding purposes. We'll probably put wood on it. You know, that's not really the thing you do uh, for a welding table. You need metal, that kind of stuff. But, you know, this is Bubba's Garage. We do things a little differently around here. So we've done built two of these little top frame pieces, you know, one for here, one for here. We're going to go ahead and build our bottom out. Uh, as well, so stay tuned. We'll show you those pictures as they come about Okay, guys, we got our bottom pieces lined out um, We went down to Lowe's picked up a couple of three-inch casters, you know, two two locking two knot um, What we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and weld this frame up a little bit This is the bottom piece then we got these these are bed rails by the way um, You know a lot of people give these things away or sell them dirt cheap on Craigslist um this is bubba's like gold right here i mean we build all kinds of stuff with this and as you'll see later on in bubba's garage we're going to end up building a utility cart for our welder um so that we can turn around and add a plasma cutter on top of that but in the end we're going to touch up these welds here we're not professional welders but we make it work and we got these little brackets that come on the end of the end of the bed frames for mounting up against headboards and that kind of thing and these brackets what we're going to do is we're going to turn around on the bottom side of these things we got these washers here and they're 5 16 drilled holes we're going to tack and weld these washers in place here so that way what we can do is we can run our casters through them bolt them on here and then we'll have our casters attached like so so that way we can uh, roll our cart around and stuff like that. And again, this is Bubba's Garage. We don't we don't ever follow the rules. We always break the rules here. So uh, it's just Bubba fied. So stay right, tuned. Guys, welcome back to Bubba's Garage. We got our bottom piece done. We got our tabs welded here. So if you take a look, we went ahead and put our washers on there. And these are five sixteenths drill hold washers. And these washers are going to attach our three inch casters that we showed you over earlier in the video. So we're gonna use these casters so that we can roll our card around a little bit. Uh, and again, this is the bottom. So what we're gonna do here next is we're gonna grab the rest of our rails, these are 31 inch rails. We're gonna attach our rails here, and then we'll use these pre-made uh, top pieces and then our middle shelf here. So uh, stay tuned. We'll show you some more of that video here coming up soon. Okay, as you can see, we've gotten our bottom and our legs put on. Uh, those legs are 20, no, 31 inches tall from bottom. Uh, that doesn't include the room for the casters. We got our top tack welded on now. We're going at our middle shelf. Um, okay, guys, long day, man. I'm going to tell you I'm a little burnt and exhausted. Um, we got the cart completed. We got the wheels on the bottom um it, it rolls and drives quite well um what we're going to do in the, in the next series here is we're going to take the wheels back off again the wheels are just temporary um and we're going to paint it up grind it up sand it up uh put some black on it we're probably going to put two by fours or two by sixes on it um not really the suggested material for welding and uh an all right guys we finally got our welding chamber all around beater banger rubber completed um some of the wood didn't turn out a little way we wanted it to uh i thought i had some more lumber and i didn't uh but that's quite all right again this is bubble's garage we kind of do things half baked if you will we just make do with what we have um as you can tell you know, looking at the top, you know, I got a 2x12 and a, a 2x6. There's some gaps here. Um, and on the bottom, I use some OSB. Um, but it works. Uh, we're going to beat it up. We're going to bang it up. We're going to weld on it. We're going to catch it on fire. We're going to burn it up. Um, in the end, it's going to get used and abused. So uh, all those pieces are going to be taken off and replaced anyway. Um, we got our casters on the bottom. The same roll is really, really good. Those are some three inch casters we got from Lowe's. Uh, as you saw earlier, you know, we did the 5 16 drilled holes and, and washers and welded those on. With, I have to admit, with the extra weight, uh, I'm not really sure that, that, that we need the, uh, the, the locking wheels on there at all. Uh, but that's, uh, that's the way it turned out. So we'll use and abuse it. And uh, as time progresses, we'll uh, let you know how it turns out. 
uh, after that. So uh, hopefully this will give you guys a little bit of ideas on uh, what you want to do with yours. Um, highly uh, advise not putting wood on it if you're going to weld on it. It will catch on fire. But again, this is Bubba's garage. I mean, if we didn't blow something up, burn something up, then it uh, definitely wouldn't be a Bubba's garage. So uh, we'll look forward to talking to you guys soon. Today, we're going to move forward with our uh, cart for our welder and plasma cutter.